uh, identity that will uh, take them into being leaders and, and going to Yeshiva Tazdeh and going to, into, in, into being Gdolet Torah. And it's time for us to take the uh, STEM, the, the, the technological, uh, science, mathematics, engineering, uh, programming in Yeshiva Akiva into the next step. It's not only taking a regular program of um, a regular yeshiva of five yechidot bagrut in mathematics, English, or, 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 or maths, or, or engineering. It's, it's going to uh, the next level of learning in Israel. It's understanding that if we, if, if we could uh, uh, bring more students from Yeshiva Bnei Akiva to excellence, if, if we could bring more students from Yeshiva Bnei Akiva to be the next engineers, to be the next leaders in, uh, in every field that they could do, uh, we are doing a big tree for Amisrael uh, itself. We, 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 we are producing more Natal Barak, we are producing more people as we can. Shalom Akiva today, or engineering today, it's not something which is done after high school. After high school is the products that we have for what we do in the high school. Uh, if, if, if we have students who are uh, excellent in the high school, if we have students who are able to go into uh, different programs, special programs that we're going to have in the high schools, that's what, what, that's what's going to help us build up the people to go afterwards into uh, higher education in the, in, the, in, the, in the universities. I want to show you a short video about um, the program, what we're doing, and what we are in need, and we are now going to develop uh, in this coming year, we are opening an educational center in Yeshiva of Nakiba. Other than the Tehranic and Zionist uh, education center, we're going to open an education center which is going to deal with the STEM uh, and, 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 and help every school and help every yeshiva and every upana to become an excellent and a better upana, a better yeshiva, not only in the religious, but, 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 but in STEM. And for that we need the help because opening this educational center which is going to help all the yeshiva, all the upana, that's something where we don't have government funding, but we, we need funding from, from outside. So afterwards, uh, we have here uh, more explanation about it, but I want to show you something, a short video about it. The revolution is not only in the schools located in affluent areas, it is also happening in the heart of what Israelis call the periphery in Ofakim. I'm 
הסביבה והוציא אותנו, הוציא אותנו מהכיתה, אמרו לנו, יש איזה פרויקט שאתן נבחרתן לבנות איזה לוויין ולשגר אותו על חלל. הלוויין שלנו, המטרה שלו זה לחקור את צפיפות הפלזמה בשכבות האטמוספירה הנמוכות של דלת מסוים. החלל, כפי שבסיסי הטכנולוגי היום שקיימת היום בעולם בכלל, בישראל בפרט, תלמידים ששותפים לתהליכים בעצם נחשפים לטכנולוגיות ושיא הטכנולוגיה שקיימת היום במדינה. אין ספק שזה פרויקט מאוד מאוד מיוחד, זה פרויקט שהעצים אותנו המון המון בפן האישי, החברתי. הבנות יצאו אה, לסיורים במפעל מבט חלל של התעשייה האווירית. הבנות עסקו בבניית תוכניות לבניית הלוויין. הוא משוגר במסגרת פרויקט בינלאומי של אוניברסיטאות, קבוצות סטודנטים מכל העולם, שהמקום היחיד שזכה שבני נוער יובילו את הפרויקט זה בישראל. בעצם השיגור, כאילו, משהו שעבדנו עליו שלוש שנים, ובסוף כאילו לראות באמת את התכלס שזה קורה, שזה משוגר, שבאמת מה שאנחנו עבדנו עליו כל הרבה זמן, יוצא מהתכלס לפעול, זה כאילו, עצם זה זה ממש מרגש. תלמידים מעטים זוכרים לזה, זה הלוויין הראשון של תלמידי תיכון פולין. זה כבר גאווה, בארץ ישראל. אני כל כך גאה בכם שאתם שותפות ל... באמת פסגת המדע הישראלי, אתם שולחות לוויין לחלל ואני מבקש מכם, תמשיכו להשקיע, תאמינו בעצמכם, יש לכם יכולת יוצאת מן הכלל ואני גאה בכם. תודה. and curricula for our students and propel all our schools towards excellence in science and technology just as we do in all other fields. So Yeshiva Akiva is working to build its next challenge. We are the challenge of the death cell. We are the ones that are capable very easily to have a not from, from the 240, from the 24,000 uh, students, boys and girls, to double the amount of engineers, double the amount of uh, excellent students who will carry on for uh, the future of Medeat Israel. And that's what we're going to uh, achieve with Hashem, and we need the help. Um, this department is going to cost us, for the first few years, two million shekels a year. Uh, the professors and the, and, the, and the academics that are going to help us uh, find every uh, 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 measure every school into the excellence and, and build the programming for it is going to gain a lot, a lot of programming from the government uh, and budgets for, for the programs from the foundations from different programs to, 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 to build every school into the excellence but uh, the, the center of this uh, education center, the, 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 the heart of this education center is something that we have to fund uh, from our own funding and that's why we're going out uh, to, 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 to have funds. So whoever wants to, to, to participate is through the Mizrahi and we thank you very much uh, for coming and thank again Nathan Barak uh, for, for being our guest and uh, enlightening us with the Iron Dome. Thank you. Thank you.